Hold that faith. Hold that. Hold that. Hold that faith. Uh. Never. Never stop. Whoa. You can't stop a man who believes in God. No, no, no. You can't stop. No, no, no. Having faith all the way to the top. Thank you, God, for all that you do. You can't stop a man who believes. Welcome, welcome to CCU Tarot Scorpios. What up, Scorpios? Yo, shout out to all my Scorpios because y'all gave me 100 views. I haven't had 100 views since I first started. I'm like, what's going on? What's up with these YouTube algorithms? They ain't fucking with me. But y'all Scorpios is fucking with me, so I had to just do another video. You feel me? Like, the only reason why I was doing all the other signs is because other people in the community were asking me, but the views is weak. You know what I mean? I started off with my Scorpios. I'm going to end with my Scorpios, you know? Yeah, you know? You know? Y'all more relatable for some reason. So, I to my Scorpios, and that's why I'm doing another video for y'all because I just wanted to let y'all know how much I appreciate you guys um, pay, tuning into my content. For real. I do. I appreciate you guys tuning into my content. Hey, all Scorpios, I just want to say thank you for all the donations and the personal readings and what you guys are having with me, man. Like, and you guys are following me on Instagram. All right, and showing love through the Instagram and through the YouTube community. You know, I really appreciate that. So I call upon all ancestors of God's, including yours. And let's breathe in that fresh ass prana. Let's take three deep conscious breaths to get into that mindful meditative state. Inhale that good shit. And exhale will no longer serve you. I like dragon breaths. Inhale that good shit. And exhale will no longer serve you. Inhale that good shit. And exhale no longer serves you. Yes, 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 yes. Yo, ancestors and guys, what is the energy play today for our Scorpio? What is the energy play today for our Scorpio? We're gonna do three cards of this deck, then we're gonna do three cards of the other deck. We just, we, we just you know, we're gonna switch it up. We're gonna switch it up. What's the message for our Scorpios today? What is the message for our Scorpios today? Hello, hello, ancestors. What is the energy play? What would you like them to know? Happy Father's Day to all my Scorpion fathers, all the fathers of the universe. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Mm-hmm. Last shuffle. We get, we dive in deep. <laughs> dive in deep once again. <laughs> all right. Yep. Yup, 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 yup. So we got sharing. Mm-hmm. Turning in. Yep. And mind. All right. So the energy play that is being um acknowledged here, or needs to be acknowledged and be mindful of, is that I and I know my Scorpios who are uh, real deep and insightful and in the occult, you guys have been trying to uh, get people up to par with everything that's going on and you're getting tired of it. But I just I just feel like you have to continue to keep going, continue to keep doing, all right? You guys are in a space where you have gained a lot of wisdom, okay? You have spiritually matured. A lot of things have come full circle. Your connection with the divine is really strong and powerful at this time. It has been for a while. You are a light. You are very abundant in mind, emotion, and body. Okay? You are abundant. Even if it's a small circle of family, that is abundance right there. Okay? And, you know, with this abundance, it need, or this wisdom, I should say, more so, the collective needs what you got, Scorpio. All right? You have to turn inward to take out all the external energies and all the energy and, and learn how to protect yourself with the divine and ground yourself with the crystals. If anybody ever need a crystal pendant or jewelry, hit up your boy KU, all right? Yes, KU stands for KU Universe. That's my artist name. Shout out to all my Scorpios hitting the music in the creative realm. Mm-hmm, yup. Cause you know, we the masters of that sacral. <laughs> so I, I just wanna say, and then a lot of you guys can be life path fours, can be seeing a lot of fours all over the place, but that's talking about practicality, stability, okay, patience, all right, foundation, and uh, that's that's why you have to turn inward, that's why you had to turn inward, 
okay, to see what messages the divine wanted. And you, you probably are getting a lot of downloads and definitely have a pen and paper for all of that. All right. Some of you Scorpios could be in a mental uh, space, uh, like going through a tower in a mental or like going through certain thoughts the same way. Spirit, thank you for bringing that back. Um, your life might feel like it's very mechanical and that you're in bondage and that you're restricted. But I also really feel like this is a crotch watcher. The other energy that is trying to manipulate your energy, the other energy that's still interfering with your with your with your energy. That's how that's how I really see that. I don't really see that as y'all. I also see that they are having to turn inward. Or that more so that they're listening to the demon energies that are around them. Okay, and you have see Scorpio the space that you're in, like you're in a you're in like a dope zen because like look at this card that like you have demons all around you trying to whisper shit in your ear. Excuse me, but like you're focused on your most high, your waters, your emotional fulfillment. You're focused on your affirmations. You're focused on your pinnacles. You're focused on you. You 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 you. This is self-love. This is validation and playing side of self-love right here. Because these energies, they're all around us. Okay? Just because you don't see them, don't make them don't mean that they're not there. Not everybody can has that clairvoyant ability. And some do. Okay? And you can always tap into those clairvoyant abilities. It just comes down to your belief structure. Okay? And then consciously putting into your subconscious this awareness that we all have. Alright? We only see a certain spectrum of sight. All right, we only use a certain percentage of the brain. Even though if you want to use the whole brain, all you got to do is cross your legs and meditate. You know what I mean? Cross your hands too. And then you're you're tapping with this hand, you're tapping into this hemisphere, and this hand, you're tapping in. Ah, oh, shit, I hit myself in the eye. You're tapping into that hemisphere. You feel me? I really feel like y'all in that space of just um, zen, uh, mindful meditation, getting out in nature, okay? You're putting on your best garments, your royalty garments. You're looking good. You're looking fresh. Shout out to my Scorpio um, women and men. Thank you, thank you, thank you for all my new Scorpios. Definitely hit that subscribe button. Hit that thumbs up. And uh, leave me a comment. You know, I love engaging with my Scorpio. Shout out to y'all, man. Shout out, shout out, shout out. And once again, shout out to all those that are a father today. Even if you're a woman who's a father doing playing both roles, I just want to say I'm proud of you for real. You know what I mean? For real, for real. I'm a father. The first year, this is my first year for being a father and my first Father's Day. So thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. I hear I hear some of you guys saying happy Father's Day. I appreciate y'all. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Dude, leave that leave that comment below, man. Show me some love. Show me some love. For real. Ancestors of guys, what else would you like our Scorpio gang? Scorpio Nation to know? What else would you like our Scorpio gang and Scorpio Nation to know? Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Boom, boom, boom. <laughs> bang, bang. <laughs> yeah. So, we got communication. Like, we haven't seen these cards before. We definitely have, all right? Moderation. Okay? And um, compassion. And what's dope is, like, these cards are full play, all right? Because, like, sharing... Communication. I was just telling y'all, you know, this is the time to be putting out that that knowledge to the collective. You know, every a lot of people on their phones. There's over 41 million without a job. You know what I mean? They're they're looking for healing. They're looking they're looking for guidance. You know, right now divine is playing out things where the real the like the chosen ones are coming up top to the leaders and that some of y'all. You know what I mean? But you have to feel this within. So if you don't feel that, then it's not, that message is not really for you. All right? Turning inward, moderation, staying grounded, continue to expand this heart space. That's all I'm really picking up. I'm also picking up to be mindful of your finances. All right? Be mindful of how you share. Okay? Make sure you're not giving more than you're giving it to yourself. All right? That is also extremely important. Um... Because there's there's a shift going on. There's a there's a moment of strife. It seems like the that you're going through. All right. So definitely be mindful, especially those that are going through a divorce and all that. Just be very mindful. This this will all end too. And I know we want it to end like 
excuse me, right away, but it's going to always end on God's time, okay? It's going to always end on God's time. It's not going to end on our time. It's God's time. Now, double nines, <laughs> nine, nine, you feel me? Uh, so there's an end to a beginning. You gain a lot of wisdom, like I've said over here. You gain a lot of wisdom, and you got to really have compassion for yourself, Scorpio. Also, have compassion at a distance for those that have betrayed you, stabbed you in the back, all right, not so much that you have to forgive you. Well, you want to forgive them from a distance, but I want you to make sure I want to make sure I express that you forgive yourself. That is first and foremost. You need to be able to forgive yourself. I want and have compassion for yourself. Have compassion for those that haven't done you wrong. All right. Don't assume that everybody's going to do you wrong just because someone before has done some fucked up shit. Like, I know, I know th th this life shit can be like real traumatizing man it's like what the fuck like you know every everybody does not um walk the same path in the same way and it's just how we're all programmed differently and who and the different forms of love that has been uh expressed to us that happens you know what i'm saying and that's where the wisdom comes in and you would have never known that if you hadn't gone through what you've gone through I mean, yes, some people could have made you aware, but some things, Scorpio, we do have to experience ourselves. If you would like to leave a donation, please um, uh, send that to my cash app. If you need my Venmo or any of that sort, I can send that to you. All donations are appreciated. It helps to keep the platform going and flourishing because, you know, I enjoy what I do every single day. I enjoy what I do, and I enjoy the people who enjoy what I do as well. <laughs> you know, real recognize, real Scorpio. Yo, if you want to send a donation for Father's Day, send that, man. You know what I'm saying? I'll use it for my son and get some more diapers and shit, because, you know, he always pooping. I heard about uh, reusable diapers. Shit, I'll give you some reu reu reusable diapers with that donation. Facts. Uh-huh. Ancestors and gods, what else do you, would you like our Scorpios to know for the energy play? What else would you like our Scorpios to know for the general reading and energy play? Yup. If you need a personal Scorpio, the best way to reach me is on Instagram, and that's all in the content description. Mm -hmm. What's the energy play for our Scorpio sisters? One more shuffle. What is the energy play for our Scorpio sisters? And brothers. Oh, oh, oh. Mm-hmm. So we got the two of swords. Okay. We got the hangman. Mm-hmm. Right next to moderation and turn it inward. Five of cups. Right? Which is talking about setbacks, perspective change. All right. And with the Two of Swords, we're, we're talking about indecision, um, juggling of a situation in reverse. There could be, you've come to your own sense of compromise and truce. That's what I feel there. Or communication wants to happen where um, there's Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. Uh, those, those cards are not here, but that's what I'm picking up. Uh, Scorpio. Any of these signs, honestly, they want to communicate some truth or try to have a truth come to some form of compromise, share, you know, what's been going on with them. But I pretty much get in that you don't want that. You moved on. Some of y'all, some of y'all, some of you guys might want it. Other you guys is just like, nah, that setback, what y'all did, what, what they did is unforgivable. In the sense of having them back in your space and world. You know, some of you guys got robbed by money. Some some of you guys, you know, your savings got robbed. Some of you guys, uh, they, they fucked up your credit. Some, you know, something financial. Uh, some of you guys, they fucked up a home. Some of you Scorpios had to kick somebody out of a home. And so they decided to, like, you know, some of them uh, instigated in situations of uh, a family, try to get other people involved, try to get people against you type of shit, try to really like fuck up your shit, fuck up your day because they don't want to see you happy, all right?
but at the same time, they love you? Like, that shit don't make no sense. So, with the hanged woman, you know, it, it, sometimes, so, patience, suspension. There was a moment, there was a reason why you had to turn inward, you had to really um, get you right. Uh, I really feel like this person was like an energetic vampire, but that's not, everybody's story's a little different. Or they just didn't know exactly what they were doing, but they're, they're, they're like, they love you, but you know, sometimes when people love you, they express more of the hate, you know, because of lack of uh, being vulnerable or wanting to be accountable and all that shit. Like, that shit is crazy. That shit is nonsense to you, me and your brain. Like, I, tr I truly, I truly feel that. Oh, let me, let me, oh, actually, you know what? I mean, I'm going to do another deck too. Let's do four decks because I know I'm going to take out at least 16 cards. You know what I mean? So a lot of changes are taking place, okay, within your life, which is not a bad thing. Now, I've been told this wisdom and I'm going to tell you that sometimes in this realm, things are going to look shitty, okay? But this world is an illusion, Scorpio. All the cultist Scorpios know this. So you want to definitely uh, just be uh, mindful and live through the wisdom and just allow things to play out. Because sometimes, Scorpio, people are not as ahead as you are. And they just, you know, you got to allow them to catch up. And I feel like that's another reason why the suspension did happen. And I believe this moderation and turning inward also has to deal with the global stage. Not just what's going on personally, but what's going on globally. Because... This time of COVID allowed people to really, uh, not everybody, some people, I call them N uh, NPCs, non-playable characters. Some people had to, uh, some people still in fear, not trying to change. They want the old way back and sense of normal seeing the old economy, da, 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 which we're in 2020 now and going to 2030 is nothing ever going to be the same like it was in 2010 and early 2000s and shit. It's just, it's just not, it's just, that's not how life is. That's not how we as humans thrive and evolve and grow and build up. Like, no, 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 no. So we're seeing a lot of dismantling on so many different levels. And it's, these things are happening and taking place also within yourself. You know, you know how they say the revolution will not be televised? Well, that's because it's all happening within us, okay? Our in, and when I say within us, our inner world, all right? The world that um, creates the most struggle for us. It's not the external world, a little bit of it, but, you know, when things become the past, we play it out in here, in the internal, all right? Through the soul, through the spirit, through the mind, you feel me? That's the internal world, and that's where most people struggle the most. All right, and then they do they do the fact that they're struggling internally. Um, they look for the outside for validation when all the validation has to be inward. And see, some of you Scorpios really know this knowledge, and I just want to say, and wisdom, and I just want to say, I'm really proud of you. I'm really proud of you. Like this setback is your greatest comeback, and I think I'm gonna name it that. This setback was your greatest comeback, and just continue to keep working, continue to um. Uh, work on that project, creative pro that business, that that creative idea. Just continue to keep working, please. That's just as bad. last shuffle, last shuffle. Wow, wow, wow. See, yo, I can't make this stuff up. I can't make this stuff up. Share wisdom. Share wisdom. What the what the, what the, what the, you know what I'm saying? Share wisdom. What's this? What's this? Sharing. You know what I mean? Yo, you hold like a lot of knowledge from the Akashic records. Like God has bestowed you what secret is sacred. Like it is knowledge where he knew or she knew that you were gonna uh, bless your soul tribe, bless your community with it. Okay, you know teamwork makes the dream work and you hold a lot of wisdom about narcissists, about emotional intelligence, about karma, about independence. You know what I mean? And so boom, boom, right here, boom. Boom, you already know. Boom, you already know. Boom, you already know. You, you know what to do. You know what to do, okay? And then the friendship right here, dealing with the duality within self. Some of you guys must might, might have dealt, dealt with a doppelganger, all right? The opposite of you, okay? The coming together of black and white on the global stage, okay? Going, going beyond this color of labels, beyond the 3D, you know what I mean? Like, yo, this, this, this stuff is deep. This is deep. This is deep. It's deep. I mean, even I'm picking up with that karmic or with that toxic energy or whatever that bullshit energy is in the other realms, you know, you guys have come to some form of terms or whatever, but down here, things are going to have to play out. And um, yeah, they're going to, they're definitely going to. 
Because you already know. You you got to keep, keep trusting the intuition, Scorpio. Just because they're not telling you, don't mean you don't know. And I know you want to hear it from their own mouth or whatever, but you already know. And that's all that's, that, that's all that matters. So continue to keep pressing forward, all right? Forward momentum with all that energy and, uh, and wisdom. And continue to live your best life out, all right? You're royalty. Look at that purple. You're royal, all right? You're a king and queen of cups. You're emperor. You're empress. That's the vibe. That's the word. And once again, to all my new Scorpios, hit that subscribe button. Hit me with a thumbs up and leave a motherfucking comment. Say happy Father's Day to your boy, KU. What's up? You know what I mean? And uh, once again, thank you for, my don for, those, uh, for those donations. And thank you for those personal reads. And I'm going to see you guys in the next motherfucking video. And Scorpio, let's take this shit to 200. Yeah. Peace.